There, there come moments when you see that change has to take place. And it takes a lot of courage when you're the Senate Majority Leader, and, and Mike Mansfield knew this. You, you get at a point and you look ahead and you see the difficulties, and, and that's the one word that I would say for Harry Reid, is courage. Yes. Courage to do what's right. right. Courage to bring our democracy back to where it should be, and courage to change the way we do business. So thank you, Harry. Thank you, Harry. Yes, yes. Yes. And, and the leadership team, Chuck, you, and Patty, and Dick Durbin, Harry, you did an event earlier. We, we couldn't have done it either without the leadership team. I mean, a really solid team that was always reaching out and testing back and forth. So we so much appreciate that. And, and you talk about, Harry, when Jeff Merkley and I got here, we, we're standing on the shoulders of this guy, Tom Harkin, who was he, he, he well, the, the thing, the main, the main charge that was thrown at us over and over again, Jeff, was that we didn't understand the minority. I served in the minority with a lot of these folks for eight years in the House, but I hadn't been in the minority in the Senate. His proposal came forward when we were in the minority, and it spoke with a loud voice in terms of what we needed to do and how we needed to return to the Constitution. And so it has been terrific to have Tom Harkin to stand on his shoulders and to have Jeff Merkley at my side. Thank you both. I mean, this is And, and, I, and th this has been, as, as Jeff and Tom uh, have known, this has been a national movement. Mm. When I first started this, people said, and Chuck, you, you know, they say, this is procedure. Don't talk about procedure. The public doesn't st understand procedure. The, re the public understands the filibuster now and has had enough of it. That's right. And, and wants to move on to democracy. Yes. Move on to democracy. That's where we want to move on to. So, 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 so my, my final, my really final thank you is to the, to the coalition, to the 30 plus groups who, who weighed in and organized and never gave up over the four years uh, actually starting back with Senator Harkin 20 years and, and my predecessor, a guy named Clint Anderson, was doing this in the 40s. And, and one of the things he always pointed out to me, which we should remember as we go forward with, and, and we think about filibusters on legislation, the two great accomplishments of the filibuster have been to prevent for 20 years in the 40s and 50s, a national anti-lynching law. Okay, believe it or not, I mean, it was still happening in the South, and the filibuster prevented us legislating on that. And the other thing was preventing civil rights. Right. For 20 years, preventing that. Those are the, so. It, anyone who wants to stand with the filibuster that's where you're standing. I'm not there. Thank you. Thank you.